Yeah. Mandate. Yeah, it's crazy. We were just saying before, it's just the grow of the game up here is just amazing. And see everyone rolling in numbers. They had to shut the gates the other week, and it's just incredible. I think if we have 45,000 there or something this year, it's an average of 40,000 for the year or something like that. So. It's incredible to have all these fans here and coming to watch us all play. It's an amazing result. And how have you seen the growth in what the six years since you've been here? Have you noticed like a really incredible difference in the popularity? Yeah, for sure. I think when we used to go to schools and they used to ask, when are you playing the Roosters and questions like that. So I think now to see all the fans come out and this many people at fan days and stuff like that, it's amazing. Do you feel like it genuinely you feed off that energy and that, that helps and transfers into your performances on the weekend? Yeah, for sure. I think... Um, especially when we play at the SCG, the amount of fans that are turning up and the crowd that early they come and the noise they make and just helps us get back into games if we're down and continues to help us continue to keep playing well if we're playing well. So I think we love the fans and they've been so good this year and as always they've been great. And I guess so much is going right off the field, but how much do you sort of describe what the bond is like with the group at the moment? Yeah, I think... It obviously all helps when you're winning, but we're such a close group of boys, and I think even last year we weren't getting the results we wanted, but we were still so close, and I think that's helped us go forward this year. So um, we love each other, and we're all from helps that we're all from interstate. We all spend all our time together, so it's great fun. Do you think that makes for um, a good connection? The fact that you all are having to be at home. And like on, on your spare time, it's just natural that you're all hanging out and building those close bonds. Yeah, I think so. I think every 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 day we're all we're all hanging out together. I don't have too many mates outside the club, and I've been here for six years. But um, we don't get sick of each other, and I, I don't know how. Like I got drafted with Nick and Rowie, and we're still best mates. So it's uh, it's a testament to the boys in the club that make it such a awesome place. And what's apart externally about how well the club is doing? And looking ahead to the end of the season, but how do you internally then just keep a lid on it and keep your focus with you? Yeah, I think, I think as you've seen in the competition this year, every heaps of teams can beat anyone. And I think um, the dogs, we versed the dogs last week and they touched us up in a couple areas, but we're still good enough to get over the line. And we take our focus to Geelong coming up this week. We've had a good first half of the year, but got another test in Geelong coming up this week, so it should be good.